What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Kef Dan the Man. Welcome to another episode of MG Cams. We're back. Today, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be extracting the coilovers that I have currently, and we're going to make some adjustments because I'm not okay with the low that I'm at right now. So, we're going to disassemble the coilover. We're going to extract one of the lowering rings, and then we're going to get about an inch extra. So, let's get this done one step at a time. Let's go. I'm having her jack up my car because she wanted to try it. And she's, I guess, having a good time. Please don't hit the car next to you. Second. That has to get underneath. Yo, I didn't think it was that hard. You got a couple more pumps. All right, all right. All right, we are underneath. I hate this part because this jack is old. Isn't it like crashed down? Well, because it's old, it doesn't go smoothly. I'm gonna pull and then it's just gonna. <laughs> See? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have gotten the coilover off and turns out, I'm sorry. Turns out we have a lot of space to twist it up. So I'm just twisting it up right now currently. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the predicament. I could not get this bottom lowering ring off or loose. So I hooked it up a little bit, not all the way, just so that I could break the tension, take it back off and then do it right. And so. now he doesn't know left and right. Cause it's just difficult. It's just, you know, I have a pneumonia. No, pneumonia? eczema. <laughs> not eczema. Eczema, that's a skin disorder. No, no. Dyslexia. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> what the heck? Well, ladies and gentlemen, turns out brute force works for some things. <laughs> you know, I used my brute force and I was able to get it off. All right, so now we've got that much thread to play with. Now we're done. You want to tighten it? No, babe, I have to take it out again so I can twist this up. <laughs> this is so fun. I'm actually having fun. I'm learning something. Ladies and gentlemen, Captain the Man is unlocking Supernatural Low. Turns out I didn't have to take off any lowering rings, but I should take all of them off just to see how low I get. <laughs> all right, ladies and gentlemen, so we got this one off. We have it assembled. There is absolutely no room for anything. So hopefully this gets me low. We'll see, there's no room. We eliminated all thread. There's no such thing as thread on this coilover. So we're putting it back in and we're gonna see if we achieved any low. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. I'm jacking it up, about to take it off the jack stand. I'm gonna put the wheel on. No, I wasn't gonna lower it without the wheel. Come on. It should look lower when I put the wheel on too. It doesn't, but that's fine. Once we get this thing on the ground, then we'll see. Normally I have Robert, um, you know, supervising, but, and plus he's been mean to me lately. You know, Robert, I, I don't appreciate that. You've been real mean, you know. He said in that quote that I'm like an annoying ex-girlfriend because I'm always asking for something. So, you know, I'm gonna let bygones be bygones, Robert. You know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna dwell on it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see if we got lower. No, right? No? I'm outraged. I'm getting it done today. I'm gonna take it back out and I'm gonna take off a lowering ring. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have the bottom part of the coil of Roth taking off these lowering rings. Hopefully that gets me more low because if it doesn't, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Got one of them off. 
one more to go. And we got the other one off as well. Now we gotta put the bucket back on. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. All the way threaded up, no lowering rings, nothing. This better do the trick. Let's get it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, everything is back. Sway bar end link, these things, the, uh, that. I got almost no low. Ridiculous. I got off the phone with Rob the God, and um, he said that a lot of people that are dumb, stupid low do fabrication because even lowering the coil over an inch or two doesn't do much for the front. That's why a lot of guys have rear tuck. Um, but Kept and the man wants all tuck. I want all tuck. So I'm gonna just do the other side just so I can do it because um, I don't like anything being uneven. So I'm gonna do this side and uh, yep, I'll do this side and then uh, drive it around for a minute. Maybe that'll do something. Yeah. Stick around. So I forgot to mention, when I originally had these coilovers put on, I had my buddy Osmani do it. Shout out Osmani, by the way. This man, though, used air tools. Tighten these. It took everything in me and a half to get this thing loose. The last time when we got the other side loose, I had to use all my force in my leg on the ground with leverage to get this loose. So I'm not looking forward to that, especially because I'm by myself, but let's see. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so I learned my lesson from the last time, obviously. So I broke all the tension while everything was still connected. Now I'm gonna take the whole coil over out and I'm gonna do it real quick, all right? Let's do it. it out. So let's begin. I couldn't do it myself. Robert's mad at me like he always is, but he's at a shop and he could break the tension for me. I'll be back. Okay, I have to wait here? Yeah. Okay. I'll be, I'll be quick. Okay, yo, I love you, bro. Hey, are you Robert with MG Cams? Yeah, it's me, bro. That's you? Yeah. I You're the one who has that Genesis? Yeah, I also do customized headlights. So. You do customized headlights? Yeah. Yo, hit up Robert, Stay guys. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Cam's on the come up, Stay all right? Tuned. Wait for it, guys. Yo, I want a signature from Robert Guard here. Uh, picked up the camera when Captain dropped it off. I'm letting Gio do it so I can go ahead and record it. Get on my dad. Yes, I am. Go straight to Papa. <laughs> all right, Captain. Play close. Play close. Play. Play. Play close attention. Pay close attention. Don't tell nobody. Okay, perdón. Perdón. So, what's that? Giovanni, the animal. The whole thing is spinning, bro. The bottom. whole coil over? Yeah, brought me to the bottom. Ah, I see what you're talking about, Ese. No, oh, right. always brings me problems. Right, we just... All right, guys, we'll come back to you when we find what we're looking for. I'm looking for you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm out here waiting for Mr. Robert because I'm not allowed in there because I'm a hoonigan and I'm retarded. So I'm waiting for Rochmerdo. Um, hopefully it doesn't take too long. I know he's busy and stuff, but this has to get done today. I will not take no for an answer. Even if it doesn't get me lower, I, it needs to get done. It needs to be checked off my list so I know that I did everything that I could to try to get my suspension to work with me. And, you know, oh well. But it's going to get done today. Wait for Mr. Roche Merida and we'll get back with you. Don't look at me like that ever again. No. Don't you look do at me like you that ever again. It's not my call over, bro. It's not mine either. It's not my call over, bro. Right. It's your boyfriend's. Right, look what you done, Captain. You made Giovanni upset. He's really upset right now. I hate when he brings me problems, bro. What? I hate when he brings me problems. Yeah. When any MG Cams member brings me problems. This is how to achieve maximum low on a Toyota Corolla 2015. I'm not really getting much low, but. Not really gonna get much low, but uh, you know, something, something, right? I'm gonna run like a F head. That ain't cuss. Hey, you're cute, bro. You're cute, bro. You know that, bro? You're really cute. Whatever that is, 1360s. Wait, 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 wait. You're going to all the way up? How much is, how much does my son want it? Oh, all the way up. I thought I thought this would have stopped it. Like, mine, you know, you remember how mine stopped after a certain point? Yeah. Yeah, all the way up, bro. Send it. Oh, okay, not the... This is what you get when you finger somebody with coronavirus. 
Captain, you're gonna have to beep out coronavirus because that's gonna get us uh, demonetized. Bro, I've heard YouTubers, like they don't even say that, bro, because they just get no views because of it. That's it? You can't be serious, bro. Hold on, see? What happened? Just, just even it out right here at the bottom. Do you want to hand it back to him? Huh? Like this? Or do you want, do you want to? Uh, I don't think he knows how to put that back on. Uh, whatever, I'll hand it to him like that. All right, Captain, we're gonna hand it back to you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Captain the man, we're back. Man, was there a huge predicament. This is ridiculously rubbing on the tire, right? Because I'm dirt nasty low now, JK. Um, and on the other end of the car, this was rubbing on this, making a loud screech. My brakes loosened up. I almost pissed myself. And to be honest, ladies and gentlemen, I can't handle the uh, anxiety of another messed up suspension. So uh, stick around. I'm gonna see if I can get this good and we'll get back with you. And there was major rub on this part. So sanding it down until there is no more touching. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So we got everything done. Uh, unfortunately, there is still tons of rubbing. We're gonna take you for a ride in a minute just so you can understand. But as you can see, she does look a little bit more dumpy. So um, let's take a look around here. We got, uh, we got a good amount of tuck now. You see what I'm saying? You see, I do have wheels that are already in the garage waiting to be installed. However, the fitment, all that good stuff is gonna need probably like an extra thousand bucks. But I got 17s, so there's gonna be massive tuck already. I'm gonna need to throw some camber. I'm also gonna need um, some, some fabrication probably for some good fitment because this isn't fitting and these are only 15s. I do understand that the tires are extremely fat, but definitely we're gonna have to do a little bit more work on this. Um, I'm probably not even gonna be able to drive it to work <laughs> because there's so much roughing, okay? But uh, we'll take you for a ride right now just so you can hear exactly what we're talking about, but the rubbing is absolutely atrocious. We're gonna have to do a lot of work on the fitment, but we've achieved more low, that was the goal. Um, so let's take it for a ride and we'll see what we got. So we're in the car. Um, hopefully you'll be able to hear all this garbage. Most of the rubbing is on turns, obviously, but it's pretty bad. You hear that? That's the sound of static, okay? Only on turns, you know, which this was expected but I did not anticipate it to be this aggressive. Um, but in terms of more low, yeah, we got it. Was it worth it? Well, if it's just the rubbing, then yeah, it was worth it. But if anything else breaks, then I'm probably gonna lose my mind. But more low, achieved. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. This is Captain the Man, MG Cams. We were able to achieve more low. However, it did cost um, comfortable ride. We're gonna have to do more work in terms of fitment, in terms of everything. I'm gonna definitely need camber. Um, I'm definitely gonna need to get some professional fender work done in order to have a comf more comfortable ride um, in terms of no rubbing. But for now, we tried to achieve more low. We did it and, um, and more moves coming soon. Mr. Robert's working on my headlights. That's gonna be a big move. So. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Stay tuned for some more content. We're on the come up. Let's get it, MG Camps.